Hey, what is up guys, back here with another video, and today, I'm going to be talking about why or why not to get iOS 14 beta 4. So, let's get started. Let's first talk about the good things that iOS 14 beta 4 brings, and then the bad things. So, in beta 3, Apple actually removed uh, 3D Touch, which was very annoying, because it's so much more slower, and it's just very annoying once you get used to 3D Touch. So, in beta 4, they actually got it back which is so much more better and faster. I was missing it for a long, long two weeks. Thank you, Apple. Let's talk about the next thing. So I'm in the middle of editing iOS 14 beta 4, but in iOS 14 beta 3, actually Apple added the back tap feature on the iPhone 8, 8 Plus and iPhone SE 2020. So let me show you, double tap brings control center and triple tap is Google Assistant. I set it up for that, so pretty fast not as fast as i like to be but it's pretty fast apple actually got another widget uh called the apple or tv widget people who use apple tv will really like it otherwise it's just a normal widget that no one else is going to use so in ios 14 beta 4 uh apple actually changed the weather app a little bit with the icons in there the thunderstorm looks a bit more cartoonish if you ask me and the sun is on the opposite side of the cloud but those are just some small little details that literally no one cares about. And let's talk about the bad stuff that iOS 14 beta 4 brings. And there are few, but those are very big. You know how I said that there's only like one or two bugs that really annoy me in iOS 14 beta 4? Well, yeah. And there's only one in particular that really annoys me, and that is app crashes. App crashes happen basically every single time I try to open my phone and go to an app. So in this case, settings, no, weather, no. Of course, it won't happen when I'm recording a video or showing it to someone else, but it happens all the time. And if that's a deal breaker for you, do not get iOS 14 beta 4. But yeah, that's basically all for iOS 14 beta 4. And yeah, if you like this video, like it. If you love this video, sub to the channel would be really great. And turn the bell notification bell on so you do not miss a single video of mine. Plus, my Instagram and Twitter account is going to be linked right below the like button. So go follow them to get updates on the next video. And until then, 